I already have a fucking hip cramp. All right, guys, how's it going? This is the um. Oh, that's fucking weird. It's a bit kind of fucky, but this is the bike I said I was going to be driving. It is a Buell XB9SX. Um, I know zero stats about this other than it's fucking loud. It is stupid loud. It's pretty much a Hardy Davidson. Um, this one was lying up for a little while, hence why I kind of stalled there. So it needs a bit of a uh, love and attention. Look! Look at these mirrors. It vibrates so fucking much. Sounds so nice though. This seating position is so weird. It's starting to rain as well, which isn't good. <laughs> fucking wheelie so easy. Over third gear. Oh, this thing's so vibrating. I don't even think you guys can hear me. <laughs> this thing's fucking class. This feels so fucking badass, I'm not gonna lie. This one's currently up for sale in RPM, but he let me have a drive of it. That's a bit of poke on it for a Harley. the mic is how much the mic's picking up but I don't know any specs about it at all. Other than it's like stupid fucking loud. Like ridiculously loud. I feel so bad for all these neighbours. I don't even know if I'm in first gear now or what fucking gear I'm in. <laughs> oh shit. Brakes on this are terrible. Really terrible, but it has been sitting and there's gravel. And the tires are a little old on it, so I don't want to go too hard. I don't know if you guys can hear me. I'm actually just going to turn around up here. I'm not going to go too far away, especially now that it's starting to fucking rain. Go 
so hard on the gears that I know I'm not speaking much, but this thing's just too loud. Um, so a few things about it. I'll put it in normal riding mode. So you have to have all the gravel in the middle of the road. And a bike that's not yours isn't very satisfying. But the fuel tank on this is in the frame. The uh, oil is in the swing arm. I'm going to give you guys a quick wipe. So it's completely different to any other bike. Um, but it is pretty much a Harley Davidson, I think, 1100 Sportster, or Sportster anyway. This thing's fucking mental. This thing, I like it. You feel so badass on it. The handlebars are, it vibrates like fucking mad. I'll stop up, I'll stop up here and you can have a quick look around it. Um, that sound is just so fucking nice. Definitely if I was to buy it though, I'd do something with the brakes. Because they're not good at all. There's only 11,000 miles on this. Um, and it's an O... It's either an O5 or an O7. <laughs> I like it. I actually do like it. A lot. But I don't think I'd buy it. I, I, I don't know. I don't think I would. Make sure it's okay. I'm gonna turn off. Keys on the side on this fucking thing. Um, but yeah, this is the here, guys. Buell XB9SX, something like that. Um, <coughs> it's fucking weird. It's really weird. So you can see the swing arm is big on it. That's where you stick the oil. It's an 05, I was right. Um, everyone's looking at me because I'm walking around my bike, but yeah, that's what it looks like. Unusual, very upright position. Very heavy. Really heavy. I was like, just listen to that sound. It vibrates, it like shakes at speed. It's not nice at all at speed. But handling it's kind of nice, actually. It's a bit heavy, like really heavy. But other than that, it's not too bad. Um, brakes are shit. Gear, uh, change gears. The gearbox is really, really uh, hard, really tight on it. You have to really hit up high and hard on it. There's probably a lot of wind noise, as you guys can imagine, being no screen, naked bike. The mirrors are fucking useless. You get a fuel gauge. Um, and then your standard lights, very basic gauge, um, gauge cluster. You do get adjustable suspension on the front. I think there's preload and dampening there. I don't know about the rear. I said, I don't know the specs of it, but it's a fucking fun bike. It's a, it's a cool bike. I'm not gonna lie. You just buy this bike just to rev it. Like that's all. This thing is fucking crazy. But look, guys, that's the review. You can actually see it shaking here. Probably needs headstock or wheel bear and something like that. It is such a badass bike. Um, but look guys, that's the video. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to you on in the next video.